Hi, my name's Dave Hall and this is a video tutorial for Gold Cup Software and Designs Knot Worker, which is free software for making Celtic knotwork patterns. Let's start a new design by clicking on the New Design button. I'm going to choose Malleable 16 bit from the Knot Styles drop down list. It's a bit like choosing a font. 16 bit relates to the size. Now click and drag a box. For the sake of this tutorial, we want it to be 12 by 12. The dimensions are shown in the elements box above. This gives us a basic knotwork pattern. To make it more interesting, we need to add some break lines to control the flow of the knot. So double click the knot. This opens the break line editor. Click the button with the diamond shape. Then click the thumbs up button to apply this. You can see the changes in the knot work in the background. So let's add some break lines to this. To make things easier, place a check mark in both mirror me options to the left here. This saves time when you want a symmetrical pattern. Then choose the left break line tool and click in the 7,5 position. The coordinates are shown in the bottom left of the break line editor. Next choose the top break line tool and click in the 5,7 position. This should give you a cross shape in the middle of the diamond pattern. Click the OK button with the tick icon and the break line changes are applied to the knot work pattern. Now let's change some knot box properties. Knot box is the name given to each individual box we draw with knot work in it. With the knot box selected, right click on it and choose properties from the shortcut menu. The properties dialog opens. Click on the foreground button, select an orange colour and click OK. Then click on the background button, select a dark blue colour and click OK. We can also change the knot style here, so let's choose Lancelot 16 bit from the drop down list. Click OK to accept the changes. Now we're going to add an image effect. Click the FX button on the toolbar. In the dialog that opens, select Phase 4 colour. Click a bright yellow colour in the small palette and click in the centre of the direction pointer so that the arrows point inwards. These settings will make the knotwork's foreground colour change inwards from orange to yellow. Click OK and the effects are applied. And that's the end of the tutorial. To find out more about Knotworker, go to www.goldcupdesign.co.uk.